Hey guys, Coach Dale here. Uh, wanted to talk to you a quick second about a product that is kind of one of those phenomena on the market right now that people are wondering a lot about. And that's the Osymmetric Chain Rings. Now, I've been using Osymmetric Chain Rings for two and a half seasons now. Um, I've used the original version and then I have the new ramped and pinned version which shifts a ton better, is a lot stiffer, um, and it's an all around better product. Um, so the idea for, for those of you who don't know, the idea behind the osymmetric shape is that it de-emphasizes the dead spots, which are pretty much 12 and six um, with a smaller um, shape in those areas. And then it emphasizes the power phase of your pedal stroke um, and allows you to push a, a much bigger gear in those phases. Um, Personally, um, these uh, rings uh, have helped me uh, sustain power a little bit longer, um, but they also cause a pretty significant drop in cadence. Um, so if you have knee problems, um, these may not be uh, really suited for you. Um, now, as far as their claims on 7, 7 to 10% gain in power, uh, no. There's, there's not a seven to 10% gain in power. However, there is uh, a, a decent gain in sustainable power, at least for me. Um, I would say these rings were made for somebody like myself who is a, a, a much more kind of a, a brute force rider, a masher, um, somebody with a lot of top end power who can really turn over a big gear. Again, if you're a high cadence kind of person um, or somebody with knee problems a lot, then these may not be for you. Um, you'll see some of the guys on the tour have used them, gone away from them, and came back to them. Um, I was kind of the same way. I used them, I kind of went away from them, and then I kind of worked myself back into them because um, to me they just feel better. Um, I feel like I'm smoother, uh, my pedal stroke's smoother. Um, as far as if how it feels, it doesn't feel any different than a circular chain ring. It takes you about all of 10 minutes to get used to them. Now, if you go back to a circular chain ring, um, like I ride uh, on my cyclocross bike, it is a bit of a, a change up. Um, so overall, um, it's a great product. Um, it's a little bit of an expensive product um, to just try out. But if, uh, if, you're, if you're a brute force rider like myself, low cadence uh, is no problem for you, you have no knee problems, I would say give them a shot. Um, if you have any questions on the Osymmetric chain rings, drop us a comment below and um, we'll be happy to answer your questions. Until next time.